Barbie and Ken are expecting. <laughs> what do the parents of two identical twins need? Watch our new video to find out. <laughs> Barbie, what do you think? Should we have another baby? I want to have a lot of kids. Let's do it. <laughs> Let's make a baby bump for Barbie. Take two baby dolls of the right size. You are going to meet your mother very soon. Put the babies into a half of a plastic ball. Place the ball on the stomach. Knead air dry clay. Cover the seams between the ball and the belly. Smooth the surface with a modeling tool. A belly pregnant with twins is ready. Cover the clay with beige acrylic paint. I'm the happiest mom on earth. I am going to have two babies at once. Let's make a skirt for our pregnant Barbie. <laughs> Having a photo shoot outside is a great idea. Ken, come here. This will be our first family photo shoot. <laughs> Hi, babies. I'm your daddy. <laughs> I'm going to meet you soon. And here are our babies. We had twins. We are so happy. Our life will never be the same. Our babies need some diapers. Outline a diaper. Cut it out. Add Velcro. Put it on the baby. Make a blue diaper for the other baby. Take transparent stickers. Decorate the diapers. Now the babies are clean and comfy. I can't imagine what I would do without diapers for my babies. It's so convenient. And these diapers are so easy to change. Right, babies? Take some foam paper. Cut out squares of the same size. Cut triangles out of white foam paper. Glue beads to a piece of blue foam paper. Add a toy plane. We made a busy board for our baby boy. Let's make a busy board for a girl. Add a toy ladybug. Decorate it with rhinestones. Make sides out of triangle pieces. Connect the two busy boards. We made a double-sided busy board. Our twins can play with this busy board for hours. It has so many interesting things on it. You can touch, spin, and play with everything. Busy boards are very good for brain development. Take yellow fiber craft foam paper. Draw rectangular pieces. Cut them out. Hot glue all the pieces together. Make three compartments. Add a handle. Cut letters out of pink glittery foam paper. Write, best mom. Glue the letters to the bag. This is the perfect bag for going on a walk with your kids. Barbie, we're here. I brought a bag with our kids' favorite bottles and toys. Jack needs his teddy bear and his bottle. My new bag is perfect for long walks with my babies. <laughs> Take pink and blue foam paper. Measure the length. Outline a hammock for our future baby. Press the folding lines. Cut the pieces out. Glue the attachment points. We made a frame for our hammock. Add a straw like this. Cut off the excess. Add a piece of straw from the other side. Take two pieces of twine. Attach them to the edges of the straw. Remove the extra length. A baby hammock is ready. Make another one from pink foam paper. The babies will love it. Glue baby's names to the sides of the swing. Jack on the blue hammock. Elena on the pink one. The hammocks are ready for babies. Our babies love swinging in their hammocks. They are having so much fun playing on the swing and watching the world around them. 
here. Mom, I want to rock the babies too. <laughs> All kids love swings. <laughs> Let's turn an old tape handle into a play pen. Take coffee stirs. Measure the height. Make all the stirs the same length. Apply hot glue to the sides of the tape holder. Attach the stirs. Glue them along the entire length. Outline a play pen on a piece of foam rubber. Cut it out. Add the stirs to the bottom of the play pen crosswise. Make a partition out of stirs. We need to secure it. Add straws to the sides. Trim them. Add straws to the stirs. Cover with a piece of acrylic paint. Apply hot glue to a piece of foam paper. Add foam rubber. Put a round piece of foam rubber on the bottom of the playpen. Add a partition. Decorate the sides of the playpen with a bow. Our babies are so comfortable in their playpen. They are safe and they are having a great time. And when they want to play together, I can remove the partition and the babies have twice as much fun. And it's way easier to supervise them this way. Let's make a diaper bag. Take a piece of pleather. Outline a bag on paper. Trace that template on the piece of pleather. Cut it out. Use the template to cut a piece out of artificial fur. Connect the two pieces. Bend the edges. Round the corners. Decorate the bag with a bow. Add Velcro. Make a handle out of pleather. The bag is ready! When I take my babies for a walk, I always bring my diaper bag. Hi! Congratulations on your new babies! What a nice bag! It's not only a bag, it's also a portable changing table. It's so easy to unfold and the baby is so comfy on it. Now the baby is changed. I need to buy a bag like that right now. Take fleece fabric of two colors. Draw a triangle. Round the edges. Cut out another piece. Glue it to the top of the triangle. Turn it right side out. We made a hood. Glue on eyes made of fleece fabric. A towel for Jack is ready. Decorate a white towel with wings made of white foam paper. The babies love it! Kids, it's time to take a bath. This fragrant foam helps me relax before bed. Soft and warm towels are waiting for you. Babies love being wrapped in warm, cozy blankets after a bath. We need felt and glittery foam paper. Outline a bike basket for kids on a piece of foam paper. Cut additional parts out of felt. Glue felt to foam paper. Make a back out of foam paper. Add a seat. Glue on the front. Attach a glittery foam paper bow. Decorate the walls with star-shaped beads. Cover the bottom with a blanket made of fake fur. We made a great basket. Attach the basket to the bike. Let's go on a picnic. Biking is my favorite type of transport. It's great that I have a baby basket. My babies love bike rides too. Just like their mom. <laughs> what did you enjoy the most? Hello.
a baby hammock, a play pen, a changing table, or a baby bike basket? Like our video, subscribe to Lalaloo, and click the bell so you don't miss any of our new videos.